Players may want to know, how can we get new moon shards? There are at least two limited time events. There is currently a daily event called Star Moon Gift, active until the reset of April 21st. Head over to Westgate and take out the spooky ghosts haunting the place. You can obtain two new moon shards and three star shards daily. With these shards, you can open up the special event shop and check out what's available. New moon shards can be used for runes, Evernight weapon voucher, Mora coins, and also the brand new headwear White Cat Hood. The White Cat Hood will also be exchange tradable. You can also use new moon shards to exchange for the Moonlight Crystals, which can be used for extra special items such as blue cat vouchers, which can help you roll on the monthly headwear gacha, exquisite repair shards, and the brand new Lolly Rury Secret Headwear. Do be aware that you will need BCC available in order to purchase extra Moonlight Crystals to buy this one out. With the Star Shards currency, they can be exchanged for eating coins, prank card packs, a Star Moon self-choice box, and because you're missing any of these previous event headwear items, or they can also be exchanged for additional new moon shards. 15 star shards can give you 5 moon shards each, with a maximum of 6 purchases. Moon Witch's Blessings is a weekend only event. Starting March 25th, every Saturday and Sunday we can visit Iria in Prantera for a kind blessing from her, which includes Oracle Dust, Oracle Crystals, Big Cat Feast Vouchers, and New Moon Shards. The Daily Star Moon Gift Event is exactly 30 days worth of dailies if you started from day one and give you a total of 90 Star Shards and 60 Moon Shards. The Weekend Moon Witch Blessings Event will be two per weekend across four weekends for a total of eight Moon Shards, adding up to 68. If we use our Star Shards for the limit exchange, we can get up to 98 Moon Shards. To buy out the regular new moon shard shop with the limited purchase limits, it will take 60 moon shards. Additional shards can be used on more coins or exchange for the moonlight crystals. I hope this helps guide you to the stars and moon this next month, adventures. Thank you so much for watching. Do you have any questions? Feel free to let me know in the comments below. If you enjoyed the video, it would be super appreciated if you could like and subscribe. I also have tips and info, ROM news over in the community tab. Be sure to hit the bell and be notified to never miss out. Hope I see you again in the next video. Until next time, adventure, let's guard the eternal love together.